Alright, let's see if it works this time. Because last time I tried using this overlay, it didn't like stop control and play control and it died. So this is the third attempt. I hope it works. I think I have some explaining to do. Death. It works. The thing we fear most. But my only fear was what would happen if I remained alive. So I ran. I knew my father would try to stop me, and I knew others would come for me. Others whose only desire was money. But my longing was stronger. I wanted salvation. Of all the sensations, pain is the purest, without ambiguity. You feel it, or you don't. I had never experienced pain. But now I knew that I could visit it on others. A pain so strong, so intense, that it would purify the world. I had learned the truth, so I ran. The noise of the funeral didn't mask my assassin's approach. I hoped for a quick death, hoped it would be possible. So I stopped running. I had never experienced pain, and I so wanted to feel it now. I wasn't disappointed. Okay, I'm that sink in. I'm not sure how about the game volume is in my microphone, but it's pretty loud in my headset right now. Some of my buttons are still working. I'm sure I just tried to press the thing I do, so I'm going to the hot key instead of <coughs> using the overlay, because the overlay does not play well with the uh, emulator. So, yeah. So this is an old PS1 classic called Fear Effect. Let's see if it works. Oh, thank goodness. Looks like it actually works this time. Alright. Okay, now that I actually got it working, I got a little bit of explaining to do. Okay, we're gonna turn subtitles on. I'm gonna put a little in here. It's kind of weird how that. Okay, anyways. I, there's gonna, we're gonna have a new channel here. This is probably gonna be the first video that gets posted on it, but we're gonna have a new channel called House Gaming. And uh, it's gonna be a collaboration of people that I personally know, and we're gonna be putting different types of videos in there. Kind of similar to what my channel was. Two main managers of it right now is myself and uh, Koenig eight and nine. So he's got his own separate channel. But uh, we had this idea the other day to make a group channel, and so it's, I think I'm just gonna start posting on that instead. And here's this video is kind of like a test, I guess you could say. So we're gonna see how well it pans out. I hope it works well. I hope we're going to be successful with it. So anyways, a little bit more background on this game. It's a PS1 classic. I picked it up for like $10 the other day. It's supposed to be a good game. I'm not sure what else about it is interesting, but the back of the case um, is a brief overview. Something about... It says... I'm just going to read it. It says, it can recognize your fear. He knew, but days before her 18th birthday, the quiet, enigmatic Wee Ming Lam disappears under mysterious circumstances. Hana, Gloss, and Deke, three self-motivated and ruthless mercenaries, conspire to track her down and ransom her after her father, Mr. Lam, the most powerful triad leader in Hong Kong, for a large sum of cold hard cash. What begins as a simple extortion mission to retrieve the young runaway becomes a lesson in survival against the most unimaginable of enemies. Immerse yourself in this intense thriller featuring revolutionary motion effects technology to redirect your past 3D characters within dynamic full motion video worlds. Who lives, who dies, only you decide if you can control your fear. So, yeah, at the time it was probably revolutionary motion effects, but probably not anymore. I actually did end up purchasing the sequel to this, but it was a lot more than 10 bucks. I had to get the original cases and everything, but anyways. I guess I'm just gonna get into it. Oops, we got some stuttering. Because <laughs> the CD wasn't loading. I'm loading it to the CD-ROM, so it's a little different. I hope there's gonna be no bugs, and I hope the emulator actually takes hold of it. So, um, we'll see. I kinda pray to God everything else is gonna work. 
24 hours earlier. Hong Kong, a familiar place in another time. Mercenaries were coming from the West, told of my disappearance by a man, a betrayer who worked for my father. I had become a commodity that would be redeemed for cash. So, you trust him? Jin's are reliable. Yeah? How do you know? He helped me get out of the streets years back, before he threw in with a triad. He's always got an angle, but I'd say he's a friend. When you're talking about this kind of money, you can lose friends in a hurry. And once we find the girl, we are talking about this kind of money, right, Hana? Wei Ming Lam is the daughter of the most powerful triad leader in Hong Kong. Don't worry, Glass. If we reach his little runaway first, Lam will pay us handsomely to get her back. Of course, he'll want us dead as well. There, that's it. The Lamb building. I unfortunately gonna slaughter. I've got the 11 o'clock straight up. Jin said he'd be on the pad. So much for Jin being reliable. I'll go find him. Where we start? That's interesting. Do we have a menu? Uh, oh, that's interesting. Oh, what did I do? Oh, don't do that. I mean, I probably should have read the manual. <laughs> no, don't do that. Okay, I think I'm understanding things. Um, okay. Ah, oh, this is weird. Okay, so I've learned some interesting things. So, there's a crouch button, which I found before, and you can uh, crouch walk, which is supposed to be used for sneaking. People can't hear me as well. And I've officially seen one of the most goofiest running animations in my life, because there's a sprint button. Yeah, this this is this is kind of running. I'm not, I don't understand much myself. It's kind of silly. Um, by pressing X, I can quick draw a weapon. And the inventory is used by pressing square and circle. And when I'm hovered over an inventory item, I press the action button, just triangle the holster. And apparently it's best to keep your weapon holster in some areas. And on top of it, I have a funny like little heartbeat monitor thing up there. And that's apparently what they like to call my fear meter. What it happens is uh, when it's green, I have no fear effect, but if I'm as uh, more intense it gets, I'm going to guess it goes up to orange and then eventually red. The higher my fear, the more susceptible I am to damage. So meaning my maximum fear, which is intense red, I can die from a single gunshot. So it's an uh, interesting mechanic because I've never heard of it before. So there's no health. There's no health power-ups at all, so I don't have to worry about health. I have to just keep the character's confidence up by apparently kill sneak killing people or stealth killing them, doing well in a gunfight, solving puzzles, and discovering items. So I need to keep her fear effect stable. That's why the game's called fear effect. But if I take damage or run out of ammo and get infected by enemies, will add to my fear. And certain certain gameplay areas as I progress will automatically reset my fear to calm every once in a while. So basically if I want to succeed I gotta control her fear, which is going to be uh, interesting. So it's also gonna be a low ammo warning at one point. It's gonna be interesting. So I think I read most I need to know. So 
so I think I'm just going to continue on. I hope not to die right off the get go either. Nope. I don't think so. Nuh uh. Okay, this is interesting. I guess that's how you save. I'm gonna guess that happens with certain. Oh. So I hear somebody moving around, and whether it's uh, uh, friendly or an enemy, I have no idea. I think the best way to approach this would be to just crouch walk. Oh, I see him right there. Him over in the corner, he doesn't like the way he's moving. That is so. Like. I can't tell if they're moving. They got guns out though, so I'm gonna guess these are enemies. Um, can I. Aw, uh, don't do that, please. I'm bad. That's what I wanted. Hey! Oh, jeez. Hey. Ouch. So it elevated my fear level. Not good. And I'm sure the other guy. Yep. Here. So this is a game that's gonna require really fast reflexes, so I'm sure I've already probably messed up. So basically I die when I get maximum fear, because probably at that point I'm gonna take a lot of damage. But uh also, I've also learned I cannot attack when I'm climbing anything, so, man, that's never good. Don't shoot, jeez, you're wasting ammo. Just keep it bolstered. I might as well just keep the gun equipped for now. Okay, so I can use that. There's an unsuspecting tool. Over here. That's the ladder. He's right there, so perhaps if I use this. I don't think so. No. I don't think so. Okay, she doesn't want to use... How am I supposed to get this chucklehead now? Am I supposed to hold the button, maybe? I don't think so. Nuh-uh. Nuh-uh. Hmm.
Oh wait, can I get in here? Yeah, that's what I thought. Do you want me to shoot it or can I stab it? Yeah, there you go, don't waste my ammo. Uh, can I leave? Oh, we got some over here. There's a fuse. Who are you planning to give this to, huh, Jin? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Wrong answer! You said this deal was clean, Jin. Oh, 
Okay, it looks like that canceled out my fear. Alright. Let's make sure my gun's up already. Which it is. I'm gonna use the door now. Gosh darn it. Keep forgetting it's triangle, not X. are pretty uh, frequent, so... Oh yeah, like that, it canceled out my fear. So I got the locker key. I don't know if there's going to be any enemies to deal with.
Oh, look in there. Let's save real quick, because sometimes games dick me over and they have these events. Where bad stuff like that happens. So I'm gonna wait. Of course, double the guns, double the ammo goes down now. But uh, we'll see. The game's got an interesting concept. Oh. I can't interact with that, it looks like. It must not have power. Now I have more than one gun, which I can understand why I can't pick it up off the enemy. But I mean, game logic, what will you do? We're gonna do about that. here since it's closer. Of course graphics aren't going to be the best. It's PS1 Classic. We need to win that. That was easy. Sorry to give you two. This must be the fuse goes. No. Yep. No. Uh oh! <laughs> Suckers. Six bullets, but I got ten, so I got a profit of four. I mean, that's better, I guess. Oh, 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 oh there's more. So they respawn him. Oh boy. Ah. Ridiculous. Ugh. Come on. That was like no window for error. Like, I didn't know it was gonna electrify there. Let me guess. I had to go in that upper one. Then I gotta go down. And then there's gonna be another one that probably disappears. Because they wanna make it complicated. It's a good thing I saved. Get it. That one goes. Alright, yeah, that makes sense. Come on, disappear. Alright. Any more fools who want some lead?
Okay, so there's a door here. No. But it's locked. No. -uh. And I don't have a key for it. Ah! I probably could have stabbed him. But... It's gonna be the best video for the channel, like I said. I'm not sure what else to say. Let's quick reload. <laughs>